When can one perform tayammum? Tayammum is performed if you are one mile away from water approximately. So if you're in a one mile radius away from water, you can perform tayammum. You can perform tayammum if there is an enemy, if you have a water source, for example, in some towns and villages, they only have one tap. And if there is an enemy there, there is civil strife or there is an enemy that, that will harm you or there are masses of wild dogs that you cannot get rid of or there is a lion or a dangerous animal then you can perform tayammum and pray if you are sick and you know that by performing wudu the illness will increase or become prolonged you can perform tayammum but you need to know from experience you can't just say oh yeah i've got a, a little bit of a flu and i'm going to now make tayammum no and normally you can get away with that also um extreme cold so if it's minus temperatures and you're outside somewhere and you need to make wadu and you know that by making wadu in freezing water and you're going to be staying outside there's a chance that you could get gangrene you could lose the foot you could get frostbite then you would make tayammum also if say you're on a journey and you come across a well and there's no instruments or tools for you to get the water for example there's no rope there's no bucket there's no mechanism to bring it up in that case you would also make tayammum uh, also, if you have water on you, but it's not enough to last you your whole journey, that could be for yourself, for your riding animal, or for uh, your companion. In that case, you'd make the yamam as well. But most people, a lot of these things would only really apply in very remote and rural areas. Most people today in cities, they're never far away from water. Even when you're traveling, you're never really far away from water. So be mindful of this when you choose to make the yamam. Also, when you're uh, for the Eids, the, the two, the, the Eidain and the uh, Janazah prayer, because they have no makeup. Eid is once or twice a year, Eid is twice a year, and Janazah happens, you know, it doesn't happen often, and once it's gone, it's gone. There's no makeup for it. So you can, and, and plus, if you, in Eid, Eid prayer or Janazah, there's so many people that sometimes for you to leave and come back to make, you know, in order to make wudu, the Janazah prayer or the Eid prayer would be over. So in that instance, you can just strike the earth where you are, make your tayammum and join the prayer and complete your prayer. That's not a problem there.